Hello and welcome to another episode of Measurement in a Minute. I'm your host, Justin Kozak, Technical Sales Specialist with Lakeside Process Controls. And in today's video, we're discussing Rosemount's Differential Pressure Level Transmitters, specifically Rosemount's 3051 SAL Level Transmitter. Now, if you missed the last two episodes, I encourage you to check them out as we covered a bit of the basics as it pertains to DP level transmitters. In the first video, we looked at how we can even utilize a pressure transmitter to output a level measurement. The second video, we looked at why we need to utilize a differential pressure transmitter and not just simply a pressure transmitter. And in today's video, we're gonna cover how we utilize a differential pressure transmitter to output level in a pressurized vessel. If we take a look at this example, it's slightly different from the last video in the sense that the vessel is closed off to the atmosphere. So instead of calling it P atmosphere, we are calling it P head or head pressure. And the differential pressure transmitter is going to sense the head pressure in addition to the liquid pressure. And just like with the atmospheric pressure, we want to eliminate this as we only care about what the level is in this vessel. Now the way it's set up right now, this differential pressure transmitter's high side is exposed to the liquid and the head pressure, but the low side is just exposed to atmospheric pressure. And that's not gonna give us a reliable and accurate reading for the level in the vessel. Instead, we need to expose this low side to that head pressure because then we'll have opposite but equal forces which will cancel each other out. We could do this in a couple of different ways, but in this example, we're gonna use what we call a remote seal. Now the low side is exposed to that head pressure. And if we look at the diaphragm, you can see that if you have head pressure applied to both sides of this diaphragm, equal and opposite forces cancel out and you are just left with the liquid level pressure exerted on the DP transmitter. And from this, we can have a level measurement. And that's how we utilize Rosemount 3051 SAL or our differential pressure level transmitters in a pressurized vessel. Should you have any questions regarding our DP level transmitters or any other of our products, please reach out to us at www.lakesidecontrols.com. Thanks for joining.